Good morning, guys. Happy Monday. I'm in such a good mood this morning, which is refreshing because I have not been in a good mood in days. So, love that. Um, I'm on my way to go work out. I'm filming a nice little daily vlog. We're gonna see what we get up to or get into. I think my deck is supposed to be stained today, but it did rain, so I don't know if that's gonna mess that up. And it's just gonna be a nice little vlog. I wanna try a new recipe getting out of the house. I feel like I've been really bad about getting out of the house during the week. And like, I've got to, you know? Also, it's only 77 out right now. I think we're done with hundreds. And it's supposed to be like a high of 80 tomorrow. So like, I could cry literal tears of joy. I'm listening to Olivia Rodrigo's new album, Love. So good. Like, on it's so good. I'm getting ready for the day finally. I was running errands this morning, getting some work done, and now I'm actually going to do my makeup, which I haven't really been doing lately. Actually, I'm gonna do my summer makeup, which like isn't real makeup, but I've shared this in the vlog so many times. It's these three products from Mario, Makeup by Mario. It's the Skin Perfector, Skin Enhancer, and then the blush, and then I just put on some mascara, the lip liner, lip gloss, and that's it. It is the best thing ever. So anyways, this weekend was really chill. I honestly really didn't do anything. I need a new eyebrow gel. That's gonna be like my next thing. So my cookie butter creamer is Califia Farms. I've always said Califia, it's Ca Califia, like California. Um, but I'm finally working with them on something. So when you guys see that, please be just, you know, so excited and so happy for me. I'm also wearing jeans, which I haven't worn in forever. And then I just have these on, but I just feel like Putting pants on today was like, wow. But I'm tired of like not wearing cute clothes day to day. I just feel like I have the most like insane closet for someone who just wears sweatpants and doesn't leave her house. So I'm gonna be doing that. On Friday, I'm actually going to the Drake concert. Um, so I need to figure out what I'm gonna wear to that. Here's my blush. Um, I'm into like a crazy, crazy amount of blush these days. So I have that, um, and on Wednesday I have this like cowgirl luncheon in Fort Worth that I'm going to with my management. So I've got to pick out some outfits. I don't remember the last thing you guys saw update wise for my office room, but it's looking really cute and I should have a lamp coming in today. So like a, we'll give like a little bit more updates. I just like love being in there. I feel like I need some more stuff in there, but maybe like I don't and that would just like overcrowd it. You know what I mean? And then the Rare Beauty Mascara is the best mascara ever. I need the brow gel. Uh, I can't even find my own brow gel right now, so I'm just brushing them out. I also need to get my brows done anyways, but um, I just like haven't made it into Sephora yet. It is a perfect Monday because my box from Thrive Market just came in. Thrive Market, if you guys didn't know, it's an online membership-based grocery store. They have the best selection of so many things. They have like household items, they have food, they have snacks, they have wine, they have baby stuff. They have so many things. They have like eco-friendly cleaning, non-toxic beauty, just like better for you things. They also have like frozen veggies, meats and seafood. They just have literally everything. I love this. I'm gonna do a haul because you can get like the best of the best products while like literally not leaving your home. Like here we have some Annie's. I love these things. Um, these are the Good Crisp Company Sour Cream and Onion. I honestly get a lot of my snacks from Thrive Market. I've been a member myself for years. Dried mango, I always keep these because for some reason I always bring them to the airport. It's like my always like airport stock. Two of these because I love them so much. These are also really good. I love this brand, but I haven't tried these. So I like that I can also like find new items. Um, the interface is like super easy. It makes me just like discover new cool things and inspires me to cook more. Also, it's kind of cool for like makeup and just like personal care items. I love Kettle and Fire, the bone broth. Again, just easier to get it from Thrive Market. All the products have customer reviews, which is awesome. And also new products are being added to certain brands that maybe haven't even hit the grocery store yet. So I love this. I like having just like my kitchen staples even. I have like one shipment a month typically. That's just like my kitchen staples, like my certain olive oils that I like. Um, actually, I always get this stuff. Anything from, I don't know if it's Rayo's or Rouse, but it's like one of my favorite brands. This is the sun-dried tomato pesto. 
which I got because I have a new recipe that I wanted to try with it. Also bought the Alfredo sauce. I like having like my staples and stuff and then also getting snacks. You can get everything from there. Order is over $49, ship free and deliver with carbon neutral shipping. And from there is zero waste warehouses. They are on a mission to be the world's first climate positive grocery store, which is awesome. Personally, what I love the most about Thrive Market is that you can save money. As a member, you save money on every single order. And it's the highest quality organic and sustainable items, which is great. Also, if you find a lower price somewhere else, they match it, which is really cool. The annual membership is $50 and you'll make that back very quickly. And then once you join, you can also check out the deals like area of the site so you can save even more money. Love all the brands that are just better for you, higher quality ingredients, just across the board better. But sometimes those like prices really rack up. So that's why I like to shop on Thrive Market because I get the best deals there. If y'all join Thrive Market today, you will get 30% off your first order and then a free gift up to $60. That is only with the link thrivemarket.com slash Kenzie Elizabeth. I love them, my mom's on them. Like I feel like so many people in my life actually are Thrive Market members and they're just amazing. Also, life hack actually, I get my cleaning supplies from Thrive Market because I get the best deals and I feel like that's really what adds up. Like the cleaning supplies, in itself are enough to like basically pay back for your membership. Okay, so I'm gonna put this stuff away and then I am about to head off to lunch. I use this um, beef bone broth all the time when I make my, what is it called? Why am I forgetting the name? Beef stew, bone broth beef stew. This is the bone broth that I use, Kettle and Fire. It is my absolute favorite. Rails, Rouse, let me know. I'll like, comment below. Um, it's my favorite sauce for everything I use. Pasta sauce, all of it. I actually haven't used the Alfredo. I think it's either of these, which is also why I like uh, Thrive Market because it like, makes me try other things. I'm gonna throw all my snacks away. I'm drinking another coffee because I'm not well. Um, another thing, we're like done talking about it after this, but another thing that I actually really like about them, get all your like cooking oils and stuff from them as well. Just like the basics of your house at minimum because you will save so much money and then you'll start just using them for everything else because it's so amazing. Again, it's just like my staples, like snack staples, home staples, cleaning staples, all that stuff. There's something about your coffee just looking so cute. Like this spoon just brings me so much joy. And this cup, I mean like everything is so cute. My outfit right now is giving, we are getting closer to fall. Let me turn the lights on. Um, pillows will never sit up because someone fits is always sitting there. Anyways, my top is from Macy's on 34th which I love. These jeans are Levi's that I've had for like six years. And every other year I love them. And the other, the next year I hate them. Like they fit weird or whatever, but right now they feel fine. Um, and then my ballet flats are mango. I wish they had every other color. I'll show you guys. They're just like the cutest thing ever. Like look at how cute they are. I stole a bunch of journals from the warehouse to give to friends. And I'm meeting up with my friend Lawrence who helped me so much with this brand. Like she has been there like literally like I can't even just describe to you how much she's helped me. So I am going to get lunch with her and give her this journal. just stopped at Sprouts because I decided I wanted to try a new recipe that I saw on TikTok. It's like this pumpkin puree pasta. I'm getting so excited to like be back in the kitchen now that it actually is almost fall. It feels like fall sometimes. And also there's pumpkins everywhere outside. There was a soup magazine just waiting for me at checkout. I actually didn't get it because I have so many cookbooks that I need to go through. And I was like, listen, I would love this, but I have too much stuff. I'm just like, guys, I have been consuming too much caffeine and it's actually getting to me because my anxiety the past couple of days has been so high. And then I realized today I felt totally fine until I had my second cup of coffee. And I was like, I'm onto something here. I have a leftover salad from Sadell's because I ate my breakfast so late, I barely even ate any of it. I found this new recipe that I'm gonna make for dinner Probably later on tonight. Um, I got some packages in the mail that I need to open, one of which is a new lamp for my office. 
Um, my deck isn't getting stained until this weekend now because there's like a 40% chance of rain every single day and we just like can't risk that, obviously. Oh, Lawrence gifted me a candle. Look at how cute it is. I just love candles. I think I'm getting a package from Yankee this week too that is all like fall candles, which is what I need because, okay, randomly this one, it's pumpkin spice. I got it at, at home. It smells so good. Like I've been burning this nonstop also. This is huge. I got it for my fear of matches. And that's just been a really good thing for me, honestly. Like, I used to be so terrified of matches, and now, watch me. Done. Like, well, not literally done yet, but like, honestly, this candle might be done for. You guys get what I'm saying. I refuse to believe that this candle is done. I honestly should have stopped it at home and got another one, because it smells, oh! Oops. It smells so good. I'm in denial, but I need to come to terms with R.I.P. to that candle. Okay right, guys, look at how cute my new lamp is. I need to find a light bulb and then we need to go plug it in. It actually is so cute. I got it from West Elm. Um, I'm really into it. Lamps are kind of hard to, no, they're not hard to find. They're just hard to find ones that are in my price range because they get very pricey. Okay, guys, I'm loving this. So again, oh, here's the update. I don't know how much an update y'all got in the last vlog, I can't remember. My bedding is literally falling out of there, but here's the office room. This um, is kind of not made correctly, ignore that, but I have another one of these pillows too that I'll probably just grab. I like a ton of pillows. I love that one. I honestly want like another one, but I have other accent pillows coming. So I'm waiting. I really need to shut that. The rest of the wallpaper, which by the way is from Bed Bath & Beyond, will be installed um, on Thursday. So on my next vlog, I will say though, like it's peeling underneath and that's just probably error of the person who installed it. So hopefully he'll be able to fix that on Thursday. Here is the lamp and this is giving cozy. This is giving everything I've ever wanted, but I've been having problems like making this bed look good with this bedding. I don't know what it is. Like, do I need to add another duvet insert in? I feel like it's not even fully fitting. I don't know, I really don't know. So if you guys have any tips or pointers, like I don't know what it is about this that I just cannot make it look really good. I also got the sheets um, and they look really cute. Those are also from Bobby Beyond, that's that pillow, so. I'll probably just put this up and whatever. I just like all the mix of patterns and whatever, but really cute. Gonna have that hung this week and then have those two things hung. I'm gonna clean out these closets hopefully soon and probably move them just to storage or my garage or my attics or something and then make these like work closets so I'll have a place to put samples. Like for example, um, this hat by the way is launching on the 21st. So I have this Texas hat which is just like our Texas t-shirts that we launched for merch for the podcast. Um, and it says, find me in Texas. It's camo, chocolate brown, like so cute, right? And obviously like this is not, like it's mainly gonna be like friend of mine stuff or actually it's gonna be everything that I do. So it'd be nice to like have a place for this stuff, which will probably be in this closet and just like have it at least on display or just like have samples handy and whatever. Cause right now I have samples of everything just like all over the house and like I need it in one place. I get very, like, it's not stressed. I just feel like an anxious person, clearly, as you guys have seen today. And it helps if I have it all, like, organized and whatnot. So. I just got a package in from Nude Sticks. I love Nude Sticks. Their stuff is so good. So, these are the, high, oh, I love these. I've actually tried these, just not colored. Hi, Fitz. You are wet. Let's just sit. Okay, thank you. All right. Oh, no, no, no. These are lip balms. What do you have in here? I scheduled a bath for you. I don't remember. Anyways, okay, Fitz, I, guys, like, when he wants attention, it's just, like, that's it. At the end of, like, watch this. See? He'll hit me until I give him attention. Fitz, I love you, and I'm going to hang out with you all night. I spend all of my time at home with these dogs, and it is never enough. It is never enough. Okay, Fitz, give me two seconds, okay? Give me two seconds. So, these are tinted. I'm going to try the darker pink one. This one is... I think these are just like transparent ones, just like neutral or whatever. And then we have a pink and then a darker pink. I'll try the darker pink just to see, but I love these things also. Oh, it looks way darker. Oh! <laughs> Guys, I literally thought it was gonna be like a, okay, hold on. 
I wasn't prepared for that in my office at home. <laughs> like, oh my god, it's really pigmented. It feels like the Bath and Body Works um, lip balms, like the lip glosses, in the best way possible. It smells so good. I think it's because it maybe like smells like mint or something. Shea and avocado. Feels amazing. I also love having lip balms in like every drawer of my house, so I just like stay prepared. Um, but yeah, those are really great. I love nude sticks. They have, their makeup is like more my style because it's a little bit more minimal. So I changed into sweats, obviously. It's 6 p.m. Just been getting some work done. I'm actually going to edit a vlog. But this room is so cozy. I cannot wait for it to actually be done. I need a better lighting in here, I will say. And I'm not sure what I want to do. I definitely need like more lamps, but I don't even know where to put them because, well now it looks like the lighting is okay. But I don't even know where to put them because I guess I could put one in that corner that just stands. Um, I don't know, I guess we'll see. Where's Coco? Oh, right there. It's just so cozy and I love getting work done in here. It's just so nice. Like I haven't had a desk in so long because I like to work at like dining tables. So even in my like recent houses when I got a desk, I'll get like a dining table because I like having like a conference kind of vibe too. Anyways, um, but it's like mainly just me working here all the time and I love it. So I'm gonna get some editing done um, and then I'm gonna make dinner later, but it's just so cozy, like I love it. dinner time. It's so cozy in my house right now. I actually kind of like it without that lamp. But I have my recipe journal out and I actually, I've obviously been using this thing for months because I've had it before it launched. Um, but I really only like putting recipes in here that I like. So I'm trying a new one tonight and here's the issue. I hate having my phone. I Okay, so like I've started putting recipes in here before I even cook them to see if I like them because I just hate having my phone in the kitchen. Like, the, like cooking is like so meditative for me like I need no technology, you know, whatever um, But I'm trying this new recipe. That's actually so easy. So I don't even need to like look at it But it's from Ashley page on TikTok, Um, and it's like the Gigi Hadid pasta, but pasta, you if love you love fall, fall. I'm willing to bet that this Um, so it's fun. just like shallots garlic pumpkin puree tomato uh, paste heavy cream it looks like so easy. So anyways, I'm making that tonight. And if I like it, it'll make it into the recipe book. So hopefully I do. I'm actually very hungry. I like check out at seven. Like I normally am like, I need to be like in bed. Like I need to be reading my book. Like I'm, I don't know what has gotten into me. It's the summer heat. That's what has gotten into me. Like do you guys like, have no energy in the summer or is it just me? I don't know. But anyways, putting this over here. And we're gonna get to cooking. I'm gonna put one of my favorite podcasts on. It's a perfect Monday night at home. Um, and we're gonna get going. Also, I know I've talked about this before, but our place, which this is my our place pot, and then I don't know. Well, here's my our place pan. I use this our place pan for quite literally everything. Like I am either between this pot or this like pan, and if I'm boiling pasta, I use like the other ones that I have. 24 7 they are the best like I love them I also I had the pink one for so long and then I just feel like I needed I felt like I needed a new one after like years of use and then this one you can put in the oven too the other one wasn't oven safe I don't think um so yeah it's just like the best vibe the best all of it it's so much easier to clean I just I love it like if you guys are looking into getting it highly highly recommend Okay, it looks so good. Well, it doesn't look so good. It smells so good. Okay, I just showered and tanned and I'm ready for bed and to read my book. By the way, giving y'all a little book update. Okay, so I read the How to Not Die Alone book recently because I was gonna have her on as a podcast guest, but I actually think it's not gonna happen anymore. Um, but it was still a good book. Fitz really wants to play. We're about to play, you can tell. Um, I'm currently reading Things We Left Behind, which is the third book in that series. Oh my god, Fitz! I know! It's crazy, you would think I never play with him. I spent my whole life playing with him. I get it. Um, I'm gonna read Full Measures by Rebecca Yaros. It's just a little bit depressing, and I need to do a more depressing mood. And yeah, I feel like those are my updates. But Fitz is saying we gotta go. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Check out Thrive Market. Love y'all so much, and I'll talk to you soon.